Hey there, Heather, hello there. It's Jeff Cutter Dad. We welcome you to yet another OTP Game of the Day. And today we are live from Camden Park as the Atlanta Braves take on the 1995 Baltimore Ironmen, as they call it. Because for Cal Ripken, that was the year Cal Ripken Jr. got his Ironman streak. So anyway, Atlanta sends Greg Maddox to the hill versus Ben McDonald. And the Atlanta legends start like this. We have Herman Long at short, Rico Cardi DHs, Hank Aaron in right, Chipper Jones at first base, Eddie Matthews at third, Wally Berger in left, Javi Lopez catches, Andrew Jones will play center, and Marcus Giles will play second. On the other side of the coin, we have Jeff Hammonds in center, Brady Anderson in left, Rafi Palmero at first base, Errol Baines plays right field, Leo Gomez will play third, Cal Ripken at short, Jeff Mantle at DH, Brett Barbary at second, and Matt Milks will catch today. Team stats, Atlanta 76 and 36, third in their division, even though they're 40 games above 500. And Baltimore's 18 games below 500, but they're fifth. Atlanta is a little bit better on the road than at home, and Baltimore, well, they're more than 500 on home turf. So yeah, we knew that. Atlanta, they're hitting. The National League numbers all good, except for walks, strikeouts, and stolen bases. They don't take enough blocks. They strike out a little bit too much. Baltimore, not really that good. In this, but Atlanta is third in second percentage. Pitching-wise, Baltimore is not doing that well. Nationally, stats. Atlanta's got some top 10 stats, but they're not really good at defensive efficiency. Sorry about that. Now let's get to the game. Get to the game, boys. In Baltimore. So the Iron Man and Braves will duke it out. Braves have nine game winning streak and have been perfect against Baltimore. The wind blind left should help the hitters. Sure they would. Ben McDonald. Herman Long. Long doesn't go that way. He goes to right in second base. That would be a good play. Today's game ready by golf oil. You slip and slip you're slippery like oil. And by Geico, 50 minutes can save you from Seeing a Baltimore loss. Here's Rico. Rico Curdy, base hit to left, and that will just be it. Play afternoon game here in Baltimore. Hey, Aaron. Aaron drops it to right field, drops it in. So Aaron does its job. Points for third base is that guy safe. Curdy's on third, runs on the corners for Chipper. Chipper floats one over the head of the second baseman. That was just close. It just floated. So Chipper gets a hit right over the head of Barbary. And it's one nothing. Here's Matthews. Matthews. Drifts at the left field. Back to the fence. And give that, that one. Oh, Eddie Matthews with one key puts it down. And it's four to nothing. Baltimore. Ben McDonald's like, what the hell just happened? They are going to get the bullpen up. They don't really have a good bullpen. Oquist and Krifta will warm up. Here's Berger. Only Berger to right field. Caught by Baines. And now here comes Javi. Javi, chopper 6-3 on the board. Ben McDonald gets out of it, but he gives up four runs, including that big three-run shot by Eddie Matthews in course him. Atlanta has Greg Maddox. He has 17 wins. Second in wins, first in URA. And now here's Hammonds. Hammonds, base hit. Maddox would love to be the best NL pitcher. Stop that discord. Here's Brady Anderson. Anderson, that's a base hit. You know Maddox is second... He goes to third base. He's got a run down and he's out. Bit of a mistake. Why would you do that? First and second for Palmero. Palmero will wrap a base hit. And he is safe. So it would have been the bases loaded. None else for Harold Baines. Instant RBI. Baines will get a base hit. 4 1. And he's going for third base. Safe. So Maddox, I don't know what's going on with him. He's giving up runs again. It's 4-1. That's not like him. There's Leo. 
No Gomez base hit. What is going on with Maddox? He's only got one out today. It's four to two. The win, probably. Here's Ripken. Ripken will drive it to right field and drops it in. Bases are loaded for Jeff Mantle. Mantle got a ball, double play ball. They get out of it. So only two runs given up. Baltimore could have done so much more. It's 4 to 2. Now Andrew Jones comes to the plate. And a punch out. Fastball 94 on the gun. McDonald probably knows he's got a limitation. Here's Giles. Got him. That's a good. Through the curve. And now Herman Long. Herman Long, ground ball. So McDonald settles down in that inning. It's still 4 to 2. Here's Burberry. Burberry to right field. That'll drop in. Race up. One for two, and he will be safe. The double for Burberry. His 19th double, and now no. It's Willie Bunt. No. Sets in the center field, and caught, and they're going for a third base. Safe. Burberry does his job. No Hammonds. All he's gotta do is get something going. Hammonds to left field. And going with a second fly opportunity. Nope. Didn't go for it. Here's Brady. Brady to the left and caught. Should have went for it. Baltimore can't score, it's four to two. Now it's Rico time. And all four. Now low. A little too low. Here's Hank. And about four, McDonald's slipped up again. First and second for Chipper. Chipper down ball. And it was a slow roller. Bases are loaded now for Matthews. He's got three RBIs today. Matthews drives one. He said this could be our number four. Let's see. And it will be safe. Hardy, safe. Well, four RBIs for Mr. Matthews. Now you put the bullpen. He's so quiz. Oh, he's cold. He's gripped up. We gotta bring him back. There's Burger. Wally Burger to right field and. Oh. Aaron slammed on the brakes. There's Lopez. Lopez, a base hit. So he makes it six to two. Here's Jones. Jones ground ball. He's a play. Yeah. A pair of runs. So I think that's Ben McDonald's last batter. Maddox is here. He's still at he's number 1.82. Now he's got Palmero. Palmero will get a base hit. So that works. Here's Maddox. The plate and it needs help. And Bates tried, but Bates failed. Here's Gomez. Gomez to run. Drops. First and second. Romero almost overslid. Now he got Ripken. Now ball double play. Just to one. Gomez breaks it up. First and third for Manto. Can you get an RBI? The answer is probably not. I mean, I'm looking at the ball. Max gets out of that pass. 6 2. It's a righty and a lefty. So Giles is fine. Mills and Oquist. So it's going to be Oquist who will come and pitch. Let's check the main end report. Some games are not, have not started yet. Lots of them. We are an early start time. Into the Shive up 3 2. Boston up 2 0 already. Citizens up 4 2. Got some games going on right now. Cubs. 3 3 there. Dodgers crushing it 9 0 already. The Bullquist will come to the hill. 
to Chinese Giles. Got him! I heat. On the change it. Okay, now here's Long. Long ground. Whoa! I'll step on first. Thank you very much. Now Rico. Rico floater. Base hit. So Cardi does his job. Here's Aaron. Hank Aaron. Takes the pitch to right center. This is dribble back of the bench. Say goodbye. That one. He's the bloody home run champion for a reason. Well, not in this universe, but in real life. It's now 8-2. to two. Oquist is pissed. Here's Jones. And ball floor. Andrew Jones with the walk. Sorry, that's Chipper. Here comes Matthews. He's already got four RBIs. And ball four. So Oquist is starting to... Tire a bit. Don't worry, Burger. Well, he's over too. And he got Burger, so that was a smart move. Leave him in to face Burger. 8 to 2, and here comes Maddox to face Gregory. And Sinker, strike 3. Finally gets a strikeout, and Burberry's the first guy. Here's Noakes. Noakes to the left. Uh oh, that's going to head for the corner. Nuts off the wall. Says 2, it will be 2. Yes. So double for notes. Double for hammerheads. And that ball to the wrong side of the infield. That doesn't move the runner to third. Brady Anderson. Brady to right. That's going to be an RBI for sure. And this will be a double for Brady, 8 to 3. Altor's going to runs. Max is not really picking up the speed. What's this one? Almero. Almero. The center is a catch. You bet. So, it's 8 to 3. Mark Lee and Krifta are warming up. So, they'll probably have a left team coming up. Lopez. To left field, right to Anderson. Here's Oquist through Chipper. No, no. Andrew Jones, and he is it. Andrew's got a base hit, and now Giles. Giles, ground ball, double play. Get back to three. So Maddox. They might even let him, they might pull him, Baines. Baines to right center, back of the fence, and caught by Aaron. I thought that was gone. And now Gomez. Gomez to center, and a hit for Leo. Must be done. It's 100 hit. Here's Maddox. Pitches hit the center, but they've got the ball. Fifth can try. Now Mantle. Mantle to left field. Back to the fence. Say goodbye. That one. It's eight to five. Wow. I'm surprised. Red Mass was supposed to dominate, and now he hasn't. They're going to put O'Flaherty and Noah to warm up. Barbary is ready to go. Barbary to left. Yeah, that'll drop in for a base set. So the Braves might go to the bullpen. I have to. Here's Noakes. They're going for a steal attempt. And he is safe. It's four stolen base. Eight to five. Ground ball, six three. Got him. 8-5 to five for the Braves. Maddox is really going to get out of this. I think he's going to get out of there. Herman Long, and it'll be Krypta who will come up to the plate. I'm surprised they don't, they didn't just, well here comes Johnny Logan. I'm surprised they didn't just let him pitch. Well they go with Krypta. And Johnny Logan's coming in. Logan to left field, back of the fence, say goodbye, that one. 
What's another year for the Braves to be screwed over for the playoffs? What's another year to find out that you really are so fabulous? Do, 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 do. So he comes in, pinch hits, and gets a home run. Here's Rico Curdy, and he's out. Nice job on the fastball. Now here's Hank. Hank Aaron, that ball, easy play. Down and now here comes Chipper. Got him. So Krypta relaxes after Johnny Logan goes deep off of him to lead off the top of the six. So I guess it was a good move to put Logan in instead. To the and Hammonds is a righty, so it'll be no way he'll have to come in to the game. It's nine to five, so. Maddox knows these guys get out of there as fast as he can, and he'll be in line for the win as long as the Royals will tie it. Brady Anderson coming to plate. Brady drives one to right center. This is trouble. Back to the fence. Say goodbye. That one. Well, that's why it's a it's a home run hitting day. It's nine to six. Here comes Rafi. Raffi to left. Raffi will be caught by Mr. Burger. He Baines. Baines to first. Nice play. So Noah gives up the home run, but he doesn't give up the sanity. 96. Now there's Matthews. Eddie Matthews drives from the right field. I thought that looked like a home run swing to me, but yay. Here's Wally Burger. And ball four. He held up. Now here's Hoppy. Uh oh, and a mistake. It's a wild pitch by Krypta. Run around second for Lopez to do. Punch out. Krypta gets him with the fastball. His third strikeout. And now here's Andrew. Ball four. Oof. Another walk. First and second. So I think they're going to. Mills and we are warming up in the pen. Giles home for three. And they're going to give Glenn Hubbard the freebie to be playing second base. Hubbard. Trying to do what Charlie Logan did. But no. Two locks, no scoring. 96 for the Braves. Noah to Gomez. Got him! Strike 3, 98 on the gun. Now Ripken. Ripken got ball, easy play. Yes. And now you got Manto. Manto popped up, so Noah does his job. Get away, 96. Griff that to Johnny Logan, who took him deep. In the sixth. Logan drives it to right field. This time it'll be caught. Crypto has nothing to worry about this time. Here's Rico. Rico Cardi to right field and drops in. Base hit number three. Yeah. Hank Aaron's coming to the plate. And he's a righty, so they're going to go with notes. Spread move. Aaron, oh, that is a smart move. Aaron pops up. 96. Here comes Chipper. Chipper will drive a base hit. And that will be all. First and second. For A. And ball four. Base is loaded for Wally Berger. And 9 to 6. With two outs, he might as well yank him. We're gonna go with Murphy? Yeah, we're gonna go with Murphy. They want to get the the knockout blow right now, and it won't happen. So Mills does his job, and Atlanta can't get anything going. 96. 
and Murphy will move to Dell will move to right, making Hank go to left field. And now he's for a three. Got him! On a pitching side, nine to six. Here's Noakes. Noakes will dunk it into left field for a hit. Right into the corner. It'll be a double for Noakes. Doing his job. Bullpen. Kimbrell is going to warm up. And Gene Garber will warm up too. There's Hammonds. Hammonds. So we will have to center field on the line, but caught by Heron. Anderson. Anderson, no ball easy play. Or I thought it was easy. Hubbard botched it. E4. The run was third. That's a big mistake. And now here's Palmero. Can he capitalize? The answer is no. So Nova does his job. 96. I think they'll yank Nova for sure. Bobby Lopez went for four. And ball four. Another lock. Here comes Andrew. Bunt. Surprise, he went for the bunt. Now here's Hubbard. Hubbard ground ball, double play. They got him, so it's still 9-6. to six. Kimbrough, Kimbrough will probably pitch. Yeah, Kimbrough will pitch the ninth for the save. He's got he's got some breathing space. He's got 19 saves to save. And both the base to first base, yes. Next up is Leo Gomez. Leo, ground ball, throw it. He does. Now for counter kick. And game over. Kimbrell does his job in the Braves win 96 on the road. It was a tight game up and down, but yeah, Atlanta basically by the sixth inning had given up everything. 96. Matthews got that big four RBI game. Maddox with the win. McDonald the loss. It was 4 nothing. Ben McDonald couldn't do anything about it. It's whoever scores the most runs. True. Matthews is 13th. Karen, Karen is 21st. Johnny Logan is 4th off of Krivda. Jeff Mantle knocked his 18th out of the park. And, and Brady Anderson knocked his 14th out. Baltimore, well, McDonald drops to 7 to 10. Both Chris didn't do anything. Krivda tried. Mills did okay. Atlanta, Maddox is 18 and 4. Gave up 5 runs, which is unusual. Kimbrough. Millwood pitched three innings of decent relief, and Kimbrough gets his 20th save. Three stars are Stan Musial, Duke Snyder, and Minnie Minoso. Anyway, here are the line scores. The 69 Expos were down 3-2. Scored one in the ninth and two in the top ten to beat Shive. McGinn beats Ohala with Billy and pick up his 15th save. The 1916 Phillies with a one nothing win. Bender beats Liebrand with Meyer to save. The Boston Red Sox Legends win 8-1 over the United Front Expos. Lester beats Hill. Bottom of the 10th, the Citizens beat the 1916 Yankees. A homework fest, 7 combined. Madsen beats Arroyo. The 48 Braves win 12-2. Barrett beats Erskine. The 24 Sens win 5-3. Soster beat Rule with Wingfield picking up the save. The White Sox cream the 91 Twins 22 to 4. They score 16 runs in the fourth and fifth innings. Walsh beats Morris. It was a mess. The Orioles shut out the Blue Jays 4 0. Bedard beats Hankin. The Tigers win 2 1 over Kansas City. Lolich beats Busby with Fernandez's 29 save. Candlestick wins 11 to 5 over the Night for Indians. Wilson beats Lopez. Torres his first save. Oakland wins 1 0 over Tampa. Hudson beats Price. Brew County with a 9 1 win. Lurch beats Strabicki. The Astros Legends win 5 3 over the 99 97, sorry, Marvin. Durker beats Hernandez with Wagner's 20th save. The 86 Angels win 5 3. 
Wick beats Daniel's clipboard his night team safe. The Angels, Legends win 4-2. Lackey, 17-2. Pretty good. He beats Downs with Percival picking up safe 30. The 64 Cardinals win 4-2. Over Cleveland, big win for them. Washburn shocks Lee with Cuellar's second save. The Mariners beat the Yankees, Legends 3-2. Langston beats Roof with Sasaki's save. The Twins score late to beat the 62 Giants. Marbury beats Miller with Gennaro's fourth save and a rain out. The Polos and Texas will have a, to play a doubleheader the next day in Texas. And Atlanta winning 96 over 95 Orioles. At the game you saw, Max beat McDonald came over the save. The Washington team winning 84 against the 09 Yankees. Burke beats Rivera. Well, Washington is for six in the top of the ninth. Brooklyn wins 8-2 over 19-18 Red Sox. Newcomb beats Williams, who drops to 3-17. Uh, the Cubs Legends beat the Reds Legends 4-0. Sutcliffe beats Walters Vaughn to his second save. Pittsburgh wins 10-4 over the 54 Giants. Candelaria beats Little. The Dodgers beat the 2004 Red Sox 14-5. Colfax, 18th win for him. Beating Wakefield, who drops to 2-12. Howells for save. Steve has for six. Derek Lowe. Derek Lowe better come back in the lineup. I wonder why Derek Lowe wasn't even there. Hmm. Anyhow, the 75 Reds went 8 1. No one beats Bowling. The Mets Legends went 4 3. Fernandez beats Miley with McGraw, 16 save. The St. Louis Legends win 11 9. They had to score two in the top of the ninth to beat the 32 Cubs. Abrowski beats Smith with Sutton save. The 2017 Twins 5 2. Henry beats Ledesma with Rogers to save. Astral City with the lockoff win over San Diego. Smith beats Hoffman. Baker Bowl wins 9 5 over the Milwaukee Legends, scoring 5 in the eighth. Hampson beats Fazio with Alexander picking up the save. The 2005 White Sox win 6-5, 6-3, sorry. Garland beats Garcia with Jenks to save. The 1919 Black Sox win 2-0. Sakati beats Chen. The 85 Blue Jays narrowly beat Colorado 7-6. Acker beats Fuentes with Lamb pick up the save. The 2001 A's win 5-2. Hudson beats Cologne with Bradford's 22nd save. Marlins win 5-2 over Philly. Brown beats Meyer. Big loss for Erskine. 163 Harvey's night team save. The 44 Browns with the big shadow win. Potter beats Poole. And the Giants win 5-3 against Arlington. Schmidt beats Wilson with Wilson picking up the save. So July 27th, a lot of games probably. All that. Uh, let's go to the news report. Tim Raines is out. He has a torn thumb ligament. He's out. And he was like one of the best guys for Washington. So what are they going to do with him out in Atlanta? Adrian Beltre gets a 300 performer for Arlington. Nels Potter with a big win. A couple of shutouts. Billy Hatcher with a 5 big day for him. Terry Cannon. Gary Templeton. Who is San Diego's top shortstop. He's hurt. Now we are going to take a look at the standings and all that. The leaders, Ty Cobb leads the batting average for 379, Garinger 377, George Brett 370 for third. Mickey Mantle's got 28 home runs for the 6-1 Yankees. Manny Ramirez 28 for Cleveland. And Elder Bell 27, so the home run race. DiMaggio leads the RBI race for 404, Greenberg 99, Beglin 97. So on basis, Ty Cobb's got 89 of them, Ricky Henderson and Kenny Lofton. Their OPS, Edmonds leading, better war, Ty Cobb. Hitting streak, okay, Kurt Floodhead, trying to get his ERA, Tanana, Joss, and Lackey. Joss is now second place. Tanana's got 20 wins, Dietrich and Lackey have 17. Strikeouts, Randy Johnson's got 150, J.R. Richard and Joseph Fernlander. Robert War, Andy Joss, saves, Mo Rivera, 32. Batting average. We have a tie. Lefty will do and Rogers Hornsby are literally tied at 383. Argy Bonds third with 378. Home runs, Barry Bonds has put 33 up for the Giants. Andre Dawson, 31. Hank Aaron, 28 for the 57 Braves. 29, sorry. Chuck Lyon, 114 RBIs, he leads that. The Phillies, Chuck Lyon, the Baker Bowl, 
Jeff Klein's third with 102, RBIs with 102, and Barry Bonds has 104 RBIs. Still bases, Billy Hamilton's put up 87. OPS, Barry Bonds leading Jeff Klein by a bit. Banner Ward, Mays, Wright, and Hamilton. The hitting streak you see there. ERA, Maddox still leads comfortably over Kovacs and Tannehill for the ERA race. Seaver's got 19 wins. Tom Terrific. Strikeouts, Pedro Martinez, 141, then Chilling Colfax. Max has the best pitcher of war. Saves Mitch Williams, 36. Now, let's look at the expanded standings. Oh, sorry, let's look at wild cards. It just makes it a little easier. The Tigers are the best team in the American League, followed by the Yankees, Angels, and Indians. Those four teams lead their division. Cleveland leads the AL North, as you can imagine. Seven-game winning streak for the Angels. They're trying to get there. The wild cards right now are the White Sox, Twins, and A's. Legends would all get in. Boston and Texas are tied at 74 and 40. They're fighting it out to for nail. Eight game winning streak for Minnesota, though. Five game winning streak for Seattle trying to catch up. And all that. Lots of teams. Like Baltimore's only a game and a half back. Toronto's two and a half back. Seattle's two and a half back. Houston's five and a half back. The top team that is a legend, that is a seasonal team, is Candlestick. The 93 Candlestick team. The worst team right now is a tie between the 69 Expos and the 84 Padres. Both 31 and 83. Just inches ahead, if you will, from the 48 Braves and the 59 Dodgers. Well, the 1916 Phillies have won five straight, and they're still like 17 games below 500. Nationally time. The Phillies are the best team with the Padres, Pirates, and Reds running at the rear. Since he is leading the NL North. If you will. Pittsburgh's got the best magic number at 35. The Dodgers, Mets, and Giants would all make the play. Playoffs as wild card. Braves and Nats are tied for that fourth spot, but the Braves do have percentage points lead and two games in hand on Washington. The St. Louis five and a half back. The 75 Reds are 10 games above 500. They are actually doing quite well. A winning streak for San Fran and Atlanta, especially Atlanta. I know they have those two extra games. Yeah, Colorado and Arizona are behind Arlington. Arizona's really done badly. The worst team in the National League by percentage, the 44 Browns at 316. They would actually be the sixth worst team. Five teams in the AL are worse than they are. Second worst is the 1919 Black Sox and then the 1986 um, Astros. Six straight losses for the 54 Giants. they got to be careful what they wish for. Yeah, let's just give you the standings by division. The Yankees lead by 9.5 over the Red Sox, and the Orioles by 11 in the AL East. The AL Central, Detroit leads by 10 over Minnesota, and basically everyone else is way back. The AL West, the Angels lead Oakland by 5, Texas by 6.5. The AL North, Cleveland leads by 1 over the White Sox, with Toronto and Seattle only back. The White Sox are catching up with Cleveland. NL East, Philly leads by 6 over the Mets, 10 over the Braves. NL Central, Pittsburgh's crushing everyone by 13 and a half. Um, NL West, San Diego, 4 up on the Dodgers, 7 and a half on the Giants. And the NL North, Cincy leading Washington by one game. Washington's catching them. 75 Reds are third. So, yeah. A little bit of competitive imbalance, but what can you do? Okay. Anyway, I'm Jeff Diamond. I do.